Well, hello, my friends. I'm Blitz. Welcome back to Hydrogenier. Look what I found. Just a, a random leftover nuke. Yeah, he was just hanging out in the back of my base. And I evidently forgot to, like, use him in the last video. So, I mean, why not try to blow something up today? We'll just put it in right here. Uh-huh, just like that. Turn it around. And you know it's going to be a good day when we start the video with a nuclear explosion. So if I go ahead and connect that, press the button, and boom goes the dynamite. Wow, that actually opened up a big area. Is that the edge of the wall? No, it even goes deeper in here. Interesting. Well, the goal today, my friends, is expansion. Expansion is the name of the game. We have a little bit of leftover money that we can drop down into here. And we need to start working on some of these things. So there's the Claudium drills compared to the forged iron. They take 300 units of Claudium, I think. I don't know. Why is there, why is there a hundred? I don't, I don't really understand. Oh, it's probably some of each. Anyway, we're gonna buy this one because it's the, the harvester guy and we'll press that button. And then I wanna take you, throw you on the ground because that's the tier one. Nobody likes tier one things. Let's make you up there. There almost needs to be like a, a bookshelf for these things, but evidently that's not in the game. And then where is it? Yeah, you, you're my Claudium. Okay, we'll grab that. Why are you broken? Oh no. <laughs> oh no, no, no. And shloop. Okay, good. That kind of worked. Oh, yeah, just stop with the popcorn factory. That's kind of annoying. Game. No, no, no. I made an explosion of goof. Okay, ready? Activate. Keep working. Oh, my word. Why is there so much money involved here? Okay. Okay. Everything's okay. Now, I'm kind of hoping that this thing works. Because it does say 100 and then 300. And I don't really know how to do this. So, we're just going to throw this bar into here. Press the button. Doesn't press. Okay. Let's grab the extra gold iron that's here. And if we create an alloy, I might have just ruined it all. Oh, no, it works. Yes. Yes. Functioning. Great. All right. That's the thing I wanted. And it spit out two bars. Whew. I was concerned about that, that we would lose everything in our life. But that's not going to be lost today. Can I not go down here? Can I drop you down? No. But I'm hoping that I can just turn this entire machine off, like such as. There you go. Good machine. It turned off. We'll take this out of the way throw you over here and then replace it with gold shiny things i just don't know which way the front is okay uh -huh, like that okay and then if that goes oh i probably need to clear all of the dirt and the raw resources and then we can place it in yeah like that it doesn't have water though but i'll just take the few leftover things that i have connect them around and that should have power now there's my thingamabob and we'll put you into here and now that should work so let's turn this back on and see if the Claudium thingy works better than the other ones. Ooh. Ooh, it's working. I don't know why. why. Why it's different. Does it give me more money? Those gold nuggets look bigger, don't they? I think we just made more money. Oh, yeah. Those iron or the, the shards are bigger, too. Okay. This was good. This was really good. So for my next upgrade, I totally want to get the Claudium Drill Masterwork design. It's also expensive, but I don't really care because I'm buying it and I have pretty much unlimited money at this point. So we can take that out, place it down here next to the old drill that we don't care about anymore. Wow, it takes a thousand iron and 300 claudium. I honestly have no idea how much this is, but I'm hoping we can upgrade our entire factory. And evidently that wasn't enough, so let's try adding some more iron. I mean, a thousand iron is a lot, so hopefully that works. No, it was claudium. Those are expensive. Maybe our new bar will help out a little bit. And then I'm probably just going to need to farm stuff for lots and lots of time. And in the hole it goes. Please work. Oh, it's working. Yes. We had barely enough of it, I suppose. Ooh, look at this thing. I want to know what this does. Okay, drop it. Drop it. No, there it is. Whoa, that looks wild. I'm going to totally use it right now. I feel like using this at the back of the line is probably better because that's where the more expensive stuff is. So I'm going to quickly remove you. Take you, put you into place. How does this work? Where's the hole at? Does it get, it gets all the way at the top. Wait, what? Okay, so it, it comes in the side and spits it out there. That's stupid. I have to totally rework this whole base. All right, it's been a little bit of time, but I finally figured out how to set this thing up. It actually works about the same. And I did make a giant conveyor belt back here to eventually 
make the entire shop work that way. Not shop, you know what I mean. I'm just really hoping that I have enough Claudium to make another bar. So we'll run over here, throw my first Claudium bar in, grab whatever was left over from last time and throw that one in too. And then we'll grab the iron. Hopefully there's a bunch more here. It should be because I didn't harvest a lot of it. And oh yes, it's working. Okay, this is excellent. Now I can use this to try to expand my base even further. So these things are pretty annoying to set up. Not gonna lie, you have to have dirt on the ground. Go away, just let go. Okay, and then we have to take the conveyor belt out. We'll take this, put it in, and then we have to rotate it the proper direction, put the conveyor belt back in, like such as, turn that on, and then we have to figure out how best to run the piping. Also, do you know how annoying it is to run piping everywhere? Like, hot dang is it annoying. Okay, we're just gonna do this. Hopefully this works out properly. I think the worst part about the piping is that it's single use. Like you can only pick one up at a time and move it across the world. It's just so annoying. It could stop it and turn. Good, good, good. And then you run out of tea pipes because you used them all up and didn't buy any more. Ooh, like time. So we'll fill our derpy carp back up with a bunch more garbage. Where are they? Yeah, you guys. Oh, you're so expensive too. No, 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 no. See, this is this is just really annoying. Okay, and then it does it. Yeah, there we go. And then and then just put like five of 15 of 500 of them in. And since I'm here, I might as well grab some of these and some of these. And I don't even know what I need anymore. I'm just going to buy a bunch of stuff because I've got like a little money left over. Fun part is we can just kind of drive the cart over here and then press the button. Mm -hmm. After we let go of the... I can't, I can't, I can't press the button when I got mm -hmm. the cart. All right, press the button. Good, thank you. The good news is somehow through the ways of science that I don't understand, we can still drag our cart all the way back into here. Now I have more parts, thankfully. All right, I think this will work if I just raise that up. Yeah, that's better. And then we'll grab the diagonal boy, put it right there. Excellent, we have power on. Are you drilling yet? Are you drilling? Are you drill? Is the drill version, is the up, up is up. Up is working. Are you making dirt? Yeah! Hot dang, we're doing it. Also, something else really cool is you guys told me to put more filters on, and you can put more filters per pipe. So now I have eight filters on there, and they each do 20%. So it's super duper filtering. And uh, this thing is working fantastically, too, if that's a word. Look at how much money is being thrown into this thing. I'm going to be rich. I like being rich in amazingly, like, fake ways. Wish I could be rich in real life. That'd be cool. All right, grab more Claudium. Time to make another machine. I just have to run all the way up these stairs. and It's really, really getting annoying. So I think what I'm gonna do is spend the next couple hours building up some more of these machines so I can make a bigger, bigger machine. We can have lots of drills to make even more money and then I'm gonna be rich. Yes! And ta-da, thank you. And I'm probably gonna listen to a podcast for a while. So let's just see if I can get one more working here. We have to take out this thing. Oh no, I need another corner post. Okay, whatever. Drop that on the, stop, drop that on the ground. We're gonna take this, get some dirt, and then it goes right here. I'm gonna do a little bit extra dirt, maybe. You guys have also told me to play with the rake, and I probably should. I just need to get dirt. And we'll slap this on here, turn it around. Mm, that looks like it could be in good place, sure. We'll go with it. We'll do another one of these pipes right like that. Neat. Put that up. We'll just change this back over for you. And then cross our fingers. Hopefully this works. Hey, the light's on. That's awesome. Good news in the neighborhood. We don't need that right now. And then we'll slap you back in where you go. Like so. Neat. It's working. We have three of the super drills working. Can I, can I look at them? They're working. Excellent. I feel like they might be slower, but I really don't care, as long as it makes me more money. Well, 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 we have an interesting situation that has happened upon us today, and it's something I didn't even know about. But evidently, there's different tiers in this game, and tiers, not, not the things that fall from your cheeks when you get sad and stuff, because that's what I've got going on, but actual tiers like tier one, tier two, tier three, and hot dang, all that was broken. So these are tier two, these guys are tier one, and if I go way down deep, our new structures that I've been building for the last hour are also tier two. But check this out. It's going pink, pink, and it's not making actual money. So uh, evidently I found tier three dirt, which I didn't know existed. And where's my pickaxe? Watch this, this is really cute. Stop being dumb. Okay, watch it. If we click on this, I can go boop over here. Yeah, cause that's tier two dirt. And this is a tier two pickaxe cause little two in the bottom corner. Watch this. Boop, boop, and even here, boop, boop. But if I go to this side, 
and I go boop. Yeah, that's tier tier two dirt here, tier three dirt over on that side of the world. So uh, my machine is processing the wrong kind of dirt, and everything that's going to get placed on this side of the conveyor belt is going to be tier tier. Wait, why are you going backwards? That's illegal. You're not supposed to be going backwards. All of it's going backwards. Stop it. The filters have been broken for a long time and I just don't care. But yeah, if I bring this over, stop, stop. And then there we go right here. And then if I just, oh, I can't because there's a stupid. Okay, if I remove this thing and I put it right here instead. There we go. And I take it back. Where is it? This one. And I put it right here. Like such as. Okay, and then we can just bring this one over. Uh-huh. Is that working? Is that working yet? Oh, it's supposed to be on. Uh, this is the problem I've been having with a lot of these is the dirt isn't getting placed right. Come on, Dirty McGurdy. Come on, just right there. Did that work? I didn't. Oh, did it work? I thought I saw a dirt nugget fly off of there. Hey, it's got a light on it. Wait, what? Hold up. <laughs> I keep putting these stupid conveyor belts in the wrong location. Gotta turn you right round. Turn you right round. Boop. Got it. Okay. Cool. Uh, sort of cool. Kind of, kind of cool. Now I just need to, like, fix everything that I broke. It also kind of makes me wonder where the end of Tier 1 is, because it has to be somewhere right in here. So I put in all these Tier 2s just to make it work better, and I'm thinking I'm going to need to build a Tier 2 in space. That's just going to take a lot more time. It's been, like, two hours already. Maybe three? Getting close to three hours. Okay. Wow. Look at all that money coming in. I went and got lunch, let this entire thing roll. We had a couple broken of those, but that's okay. There is so much coin. Even we're getting a lot of Claudium now, which is amazing because it took so much to make everything back here. I know it's dark and creepy, but that's okay. That's what caves are supposed to be. Why is that broken? Oh, those lights just... Did we not have enough pressure? Did my pressure tank die? No, it's still there. Oh, maybe the game just can't render all the lights anymore. But yeah, check it out. All of these are going. We're sending in tons and tons and tons of dirt. And the sounds aren't even working. <laughs> Oh, there it goes. Oh, they are running out of power or something. I didn't notice that before. Yeah, but listen to that grounding sound. Oh, yeah. That's satisfying. <laughs> yeah, so all of these are going. The top side is also going. Let's go up there quick. I also made nice little walkways because it was really bothering me. So, yeah, we can go up here and just run on the treadmill. Whoa! Run on the treadmill all the way through. Yes! I totally didn't realize those weren't powered. My game is chugging so badly. There must be an incredible amount of money in there. Or gems. It's probably the gems. So I'll come back here for the 729th time. Buy another Claudium pipe. Buy that thing. Jump down the hole. Totally gonna flush this. There's gotta be so much in there. <laughs> oh my word. Okay, there we go. Oh, that was, that was the cause. Of, did I crash the game? Better not crash the game. Please don't crash. I haven't done that in like two hours. Oh, it worked. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Wow, and we're actually getting big gems now too instead of just little tiny nuggets of gems. That's awesome. Uh-oh. I'm so sorry, green one. You need to get in here. All right, so I need to like recalibrate my entire system right now. I don't know how to do this the best. Um, you know, I don't need actually, I don't need two of these on. If I take these off, grab that pipe, everything shuts down. Take you, put you in here like that. Rotate you around, flop you like so, then rotate you back, open up. Now I can dump in this one. This has got to be a huge bar of power juice. So we'll just gently shove that. And I said, we're going to just gently shove you into the hole. Sho shove right Put it just right in just right in there. Okay, and then drop it. Thank you. There we go. Hopefully that has power now. This is why you always check your work before you turn in your homework. There we go. It's sustaining power now. I'm kind of curious too, because I haven't sold much of the gold. I really want to know how much of this it is. Should we just take the gold bar? Oh my word, look at all that money coming in. I like too how the ore is now bigger than the little dirt chunks that's in. I don't know how it makes, makes it work, but it's some sort of like matter manipulation grinder all right <laughs> look at it all go that's hilarious okay ready to get set flop okay i'm gonna take this i need to see what oh, oh, just literally just broke there we go let's go see how much this bar is worth alone my guess is somewhere in the seven figure range i have no idea though it might just be stupidly cheap and i'm just thinking it's gonna be expensive and i also forgot where i can sell these at 
Nope, that's blades. And this one's necklaces and rings. Ooh, this one's the jeweler. The jeweler should be able to. Oh, I'm so excited. Are you excited? I'm excited. <laughs> There's a number over there. I can't even tell it. Why is it so big? There's numbers that I can't even see what they are. That's a four. But if I buy it, can I just... <laughs> is that... That's a $12 million ingot. Wow. <laughs> I'm rich. I'm richer than rich. $12 million. I could buy like four Twitter accounts or something. I don't even know what to do with it. I didn't want to sell it because now I... I guess I could go make more. I could buy... I could buy a, like a buttload of nukes. I also like the fact that it says it's a mini nuke. Implying that there's going to be a large nuke coming in the future, which would be very nice. I wonder if I would have made that bar into a necklace, how much more money it would be worth. All right, how much is a truck full of nukes? That's a lot of money. <laughs> but I still have a lot of money. <laughs> I just bought a million dollars worth of nukes. Okay, you're going to stay right in here. Kind of feels bad to bring a cart full of nukes through lava. But I don't think they'll blow up. <clears throat> oh, yeah. oh, there we go. Up the hill. Mm, bu -bu 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 -bu. I don't really know what I was gonna use these for. Also, I probably shouldn't have brought, bought another one because I already have a card back here and it's getting a little bit cluttered. All right, three, two, one, boom. Oh, please don't blow up anything bad. If that caused a chain reaction, I lost my whole card. I'm gonna be crying. Where am I? I can't see. Everything's bright and shiny. Oh, there we go. Oh, I didn't even lose anything, but that was super close. <laughs> oh, there we go. I just burst my way through the other side. So I don't really need all of these things anymore. I'm just going to kind of put them right over here. Yeah, I don't even know what a centralizer hook means. Don't need that. Don't need this. Uh, you know, that might be in the splash range anyway. So let's just go ahead and fire off another nuke. <laughs> Good. Beautiful. We almost cleared it all out. We made $12 million and had a very exciting time doing it. So my friends, thank you for watching today's episode. I hope you liked me building this because it took absolutely forever. So thank you for watching and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time. And I'd like to thank all of the patrons and YouTube members, including Auto Dave, Beaninator, Ben, Dickie James, Moonstorm, Teddy Hippius, Eagle Art, Destructo Man, Maxor, Spencer T, VC Engineer, Whip It Good, Baron, Fox, Zarnoff, Deegan, Jason L, Rail, Whiskey, Splatter Sacks, Joe B, Doug Rules 2.0, Fury Arrow, Nerdy Keeks, Gunk Chess, McCorian, Link Hewitt, Brad Elvis, Rob the King, KDF, Dalton C, Blair B, Psycho T, Hervora, MRM Gaming, Terrarian Gamer, and Raphael P.